What is up everyone, it's Hayes here and welcome back to Life is Strange episode 5 Polarized. So right now we're in the Zeitgeist Gallery in Los Angeles and it seems like everything is okay and we fulfilled our dreams and... Come on Principal Wells, let me talk man! Oh come on, oh it's this guy, okay. Let's get away from him and yeah, it seems like everything is okay and... Max! Don't say anything stupid. You just did. You just interrupted my intro, Max. How dare you? Okay. Oh, come on. Everybody has to be talking in here. So, yeah. It seems like uh, everything is cool and okay, but, you know, not everything is as it seems. He'll think about those days for the rest of his life in prison. Wow, this is Jefferson, really? Fuck that guy, man. Fuck that guy. But he's finally gone, so let's have some champagne and get drunk and forget about everything. Okay, maybe not. Wow, is that sushi? Oh, no, that's not sushi. I guess I have to get used to the idea of fancy food I don't want to eat. Nah, if you don't want to eat, just don't do it. Hey, Principal Wells. So, how are you handling your new fame as a photographer? I don't feel like a famous photographer yet. Every journey starts with the first step. I'm only a Blackwell bureaucrat, not an artist. But you've made us proud with the great response to your work so far. Well, it's kind of surreal. It's kind of surreal to be here after <laughs> Just said everything that. that happened at Blackwell. All the more reason to celebrate your success. Maybe I feel guilty for celebrating. Leave that to me. I... I should have been more proactive about Kate Marsh and her awful situation. She's strong, and I'm glad she made it out of that hell. I should have put my foot down with Nathan Prescott. Or put my foot in his ass. <laughs> okay. Well, finally, finally you're talking like a real man. Uh, Jefferson fooled us. Mark Jefferson was good about hiding his tracks. We were all fooled by him. Most of all me. As you might know, I have a weakness for prestige. And Jefferson had such a great reputation. Nobody expected him to be so disturbed. I couldn't believe the police found those sick photos in his dark room. Oh, those poor girls. At least he's in jail along with Nathan for kidnapping and murder. And Sean Prescott is now under serious investigation for all his years of corruption. Money and power can only protect you for so long. Bay. The irony is that for once, Sean Prescott actually had no clue what was going on with Jefferson. And he even brought him to Blackwell. Wow, <laughs> okay. Maybe it's karma. I'd like to think there's some karma involved. The Prescotts have had this coming. I do believe that what goes around comes around. I just hope it's all good for a change. I'm hoping this is a fresh start, Principal Wells. Like I said before, you're an adult now. You can call me Ray. Oh, oh can I? For this event. Oh. Now, if you'll excuse me, I hear the buffet calling me again. All right, all right. You eat all the fancy food and especially all the caviar, man. I'm just gonna take a look around these photos or pictures. Mm, I don't know. I'm not really into this kind of art, but this looks. Can you tell me something about well, this? This is the best everyday hero show I've seen since it began. <laughs> All the pictures say a lot about our times. Bravo. Yeah, especially this one, right? <laughs> okay. Let's move forward with our life. Hey, Mr. Journalist. Hi, excuse me, you're Max Caulfield, right? Yeah, that's me. Uh, yeah. Yes. Sorry to bother you, but my name is Danny Lee, and I'm oh. with the Berkeley People's Herald. Okay, call me your teeth, man. Section, and I totally dig your work. Now, I know the whole ironic selfie thing is kind of played out, but there's something timeless about your images. So I, I'd love to set up an appointment or, or interview with you when you get a chance. Uh, here's my card. So great talking with oh, you, Max. What... You too, Danny. I didn't say anything, man. It was like the fastest conversation in my life that I e didn't even take a part in. Wow, what the fuck? Is this Bad what a life... What? Training. What? Could have done this so much better. 
Well, okay, if you say so, man. But you're not in this gallery, so that means you suck. Okay. This makes me feel so sad. Like I was back in high school. <laughs> so I guess your high school days were really God, sad then. I love art. Oh. <laughs> okay, and what do we have here? Yep, that's my picture. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. Oh my god. Forgot to turn that off again. Shit. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least for today. Oh shit. Nosebleed. Fucking hell. I guess we forgot about one thing, and that is the tornado. Shit. This thing is still happening, Max. I'm gonna do something about it. Are you okay? Oh man. We lost uh, you there for a second. Your nose. Uh, <laughs> High altitude. What was the voice? <laughs> I completely forgot about that one. Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh shit. Oh, come on. Please answer. What? Oh no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm, Chloe, I'm can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Well, that didn't go well. Oh my god. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Oh man. Maybe the base can be destroyed. <laughs> okay, this is some nice art, but. There has to be a way to stop this. For good. Hey, what's up, girl? Okay, we have no time for this right now. We gotta... <laughs> fucking tongue got stuck. Okay, we gotta go and save Arcadia Bay and Chloe. As Max said, we didn't fix shit, so we gotta go back in time again. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. Okay, let's focus. Almost there. Excuse me. Oh fuck you, man. You questions about your work? Sorry, but No time. Shut the fuck up, man. Got to stop a tornado from coming and a friend from dying. Shit. Okay, here we go. And there we have it. Oh Come shit. What is going on now? I guess we're going it way like too back. Breaking apart. Oh my god. What am I doing to time? <sighs> well, it's not you, it's me doing all this shit, but we we're fucking up badly. One simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Yeah, let's just destroy the photo. I mean, it's a nice photo, but... Sorry, San Francisco. Uh, Chloe comes that's first. true, that's true, actually. I agree with that. You go, Max. You go, girl. But is this gonna... Is this really gonna play out the way that we want it to play out? Well, it seems like it won't play out as we planned. Oh, fuck. And we're back in the dark room. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Oh, you shit face. The Jefferson should be in jail, not here. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. 
Oh, this is the most important decision of this episode. Eat shit and die. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. I know, right? Hey, your nose is bleeding. Don't touch me. Probably fucking freak. A dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. No. Oh, as if you care. Motherfucker killed her or what? I completely forgot about this one. Holy shit. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. Okay, well, this is the reason That's why we're why here. here. Yeah, exactly. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird. Well, look who's talking about weirdness. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh. Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. Well, it sounded like I Samuel. These images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, shh, shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. What a motherfucker. Okay, we gotta do something about this, Max. Come on. Come on, girl. Please. Oh, shit. Don't do this. There's the lethal dose of whatever that is. I have no idea what that is. But that's gonna kill us if we don't do something about it. Oh shit, here we go. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. Kick him in the balls! Or oh, maybe not, okay. What? Ha! Ooh, yeah. David! Fight him, man! Oh shit. Ow! David, no! Jesus. Well, this just happened. We gotta go. We gotta go back, man, and do something about this. We gotta help David. Okay, let's go all the way back. I promise you. Can no skip. Okay. Please. Shit. Wait. Hold on. Can I? Can okay. I okay. For one last request. Oh. You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? That's right. You can't. Well, if I remember correctly, some water. Excuse me, but maybe my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. Especially when you're trying to kill me. Wow. <laughs> what an asshole. What a disturbed person. But what a great villain. Gotta say. Well, thank you, son of a bitch. Now it's time for payback. Okay. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. But what? Okay, here we go. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Because <laughs> I'm a motherfucking time traveler, bitch! <laughs> Whoop! Ha! Motherfucker. 
There you go. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. Well, shit. David Manson. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. A real bullet. Fuck you, man. Okay, gotta go back. That didn't work out as well. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. Oh. But I am. Ha! Boom, bitch! Fucking wasted, man. Oh, there it is. Max, are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. I'm okay. Thank you, David. Thank you. No, thank me. You brought me here. Oh, that's right. Not wasted yet. Three, two, one, and boom! <laughs> there you go. Be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson. That's right. Now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Look at you now. Save Chloe. Well, everything. we have a oh shit. Including Again with the steam. Warren. I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Okay, okay. We can steal Jefferson's yeah, car. Jefferson, but and this anymore. go for Warren's photo. But first, let's Good look God. at this. It's a studio. Jefferson looks so pathetic now. Yeah. Let's talk to David first. David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was... was gonna kill me. Like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that... Well, so it happened. He actually killed Victoria, man. That I didn't... I never realized that. Wow. Wow, okay. Nah, let's not give him shit. I never did. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. That's he right. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. Well, you still had the right idea to tell the principal that Jefferson acted shady around Kate Marsh. And Max, I treated Kate like shit. I know she's a good person, but I'm not. I hope I get to tell her that soon. Uh, don't be so hard on yourself, man. You're a good man, even though you're not really good at showing it, but... Me oh, too. shit. I think that would make her very happy. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel and... Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and... almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But yep. I have to admit... Whole premise I'm of this game. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys, but you had each other. Well, I guess she learned from you. Maybe she learned from you. I think she only learned how to hate my guts. You both had a tough start. And I know it wasn't easy. I'm not going to make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too. When Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That I'm so game sorry. fucked me over, man. <laughs> that game I fucked me over. To happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams. Who kept all those files? I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... 
It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. Oh, man. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she? She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. Well, Joyce, I would go we have a problem, I guess. Uh, I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. Yeah, that's not going to happen right now. Dad. Shit. Maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. So, where is Chloe? Oh, shit. Here we go. So. Uh, you. I obviously know what happens in both of these. But. Even in my first playthrough, I chose to hide the truth. Because. David, um, it just feels right, you know? At this moment. Pretty stressed out, so. Um, she went to go. Uh, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside well, and get some if you here. only knew, David. And use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Go on now. You've seen enough of this room. Yeah, I don't want to stay here for another minute, or maybe not even for okay. another second. Teacher, let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. Oh, there's a whole lot of sick Dave stuff. The truth. He um, Frank fun, isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs. Yeah, that's life. true, but let's not think about that too much right now, okay? You won't be going, Jefferson. To any more shows. Oh, Chloe's necklace. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna save you. For the last time. And I'm gonna take it. How? There's no way I'm leaving your necklace here. Will you put it on? Ah, uh, you just put it... Put that in your pocket, okay. Actually, I have the same necklace. The bullet necklace. I have it on me right now. Maybe you even hear the bullets clinging. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I love Chloe's character so much. Freedom. So I had to get this necklace. I love her style. But right now we have a different yes. kind of problem. We need to find Warren and his photo. Warren, if you remember. Can you hear me? When he was drunk. Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thinks it's Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. I have a car. Okay, me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. I'm on my way. I don't know when Max learned to drive, but here we go. It's a fancy car that Jefferson has. Well, obviously with all the Prescott money. Maybe he afforded this on his own, I don't know. But Jefferson's over now, and we'll have to deal with the real problem with the storm. Okay, Arcadia Bay is pretty much fucked up right now. I trust Limbo have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. <laughs> Somebody okay. Oh. Don't take it on drive, Max. Okay. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's me. Oh, shit. I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel. 
Oh man. Oh man, this hurts. This hurts because at some point I kinda feel for Nathan. I don't know it's a, I know it sounds weird, but some of his personality traits, it just... I don't know. I feel bad for him. You know, now that I know all this stuff about him and his father and... The troubles that he had and has... It's just... I just feel bad for him. It was out of, out of his control. Okay, here we are. Apocalypse is apparently happening and we are the only ones who can stop it so let's work on that right now holy shit this thing is huge I think Mark Jefferson's ego just manifested itself into the form of a storm Okay. Hurry up. Oh shit, everyone is Oh trucker. That guy is trapped. Let's help him. Thanks, kid. Are you okay? Once I get the hell out of here. Okay, let's just move this. You go, man. You go as well. Whoa. Okay. Everything is fucked. Everything is... Whoa, really? Hey, 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 don't... Don't get in my way, guys. I got some really important shit to do right here. And... Whoop! Rest in peace, even. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, let's try and save him. Fuck that shot. Get out of here, man. Nah, I'm good, man. Well, Evan is the kind of photographer that would just give everything for a good shot. Even his life. Wow, this whale. Oh, man. Oh, hey, Alyssa. Okay, let's try and help Alyssa. You know, in the end... We're her guardian angel, or whatever. <laughs> yeah, let's do just that. Okay, here we have this plank. Very convenient plank, by the way. And we can use that to make a bridge. Please don't fall on me. Oh shit, that was close. Closer and close. You did it, Pap. Are you okay? That I did. Now I am. We need to get out of here. Alyssa, you go on. I have to help other people. Oh, I have the necklace on me. Wow. Oh shit. That was close. That was close. Thank you, Alyssa. Now we're even. Be careful out there. Look at that. I have Chloe's necklace. Wow. Oh man. Let's make this right. Let's go through here and... Whoa, what is going on in here? Oh, shit. That's a dead body. Okay, let's let's not stay over there. We have... 
much bigger things to do and people to see how can i get out of here if i remember correctly there's a guy yeah the fisherman and we got to use this first but when we use this this happens He's dead. shit Electrocuted. now we killed an innocent person and we are no better than Jefferson. Okay. Ah, he's still dead. Come on. <laughs> we need to go way more back than that. Okay. Dude, you gotta move. Or something. I don't know. Okay, we gotta get in there first. Oh, now I now now I remember. We gotta use it. We gotta yeah, it's bad, but we gotta kill the guy first. Get in here. Rewind. Resurrect this guy and talk to him. Come on, you have to get out of here right now. I need to breathe. I need air. Just go outside, man. I can't die in this room. I can't. Okay, let's use the fuse box. Fuse box now. You should get out of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. Okay, okay, we're good. Now, we can... <coughs> sorry. We can go to diner, to the diner and get the photo finally and fix all of this. All of this shit that's happening right now. And as you can see, there's a whole lot of shit going on. Okay. Here we go. Wow. It's like boats and everywhere and the thing on the diner when you look at it this way it says die. Well, the, the well <laughs> okay, this sucks. But we can stop it and I know how. Just put some sand on it and you're okay. And that's another point for Team Max. Okay. Oh, how did that? How did the car get up there? Oh man! Holy shit! Just look at his eyes. Oh, that's creepy, man. Well, rest in peace, Officer Barry. He was a good guy. Oh shit! I forgot to warn the homeless woman. Oh man! Now I feel bad. Holy crap! E6 tornado. Wow, that's gotta be strong, right? Max. Oh, Max. Yep, here I am, guys. Oh, to save the world. So glad to see you, sweetie. Or maybe just Arcadia okay? Bay. Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh. Or Officer Barry and Officer Oh, yeah. I oh, know. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce. But it's all we have. You okay, Warren? Nice shirt, by the way. How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. Ah, uh, don't beat yourself up, Warren. You couldn't I'm really so do a whole lot. Um, but I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Sorry, no more music. Yeah. No, no, I'm just Hello, Pompidou. Can I do anything with you? I can just look at you. Haley Spring still has Pompidou at his side. No, oh, he's sad. Okay, so we have to deal with this whole situation. This episode. But it seems like in the next episode, we'll wrap up this story and it will be the final episode of Life is Strange. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe if you want to see more stuff because there's definitely more stuff coming. So have a nice day and cheers!